Hey everybody, Mariko Curry here, bringing you an update video on basically where I've been for the last couple of uh, days, or weeks in this case. Uh, for one, I wanted to apologize for saying that I was returning back to videos and then just ending up not actually doing that. Uh, the thing is, I have a couple things I've been going uh, through these last couple of weeks, so... Well, you know what? First, let's get into a match, uh, and then we'll... I'll discuss about it. Let's see... It's, I always like Port Town Aero Dive. It's always my first choice whenever I want to do a Omega stage. So, to start off, uh... Yeah, where have I been lately? Uh, actually at home. I haven't really been, uh, really, like, out or gone somewhere. I could have probably made a video if I only didn't lose my original capture device. Uh, my original capture device was S-Video and uh, Composite, and during my trip to Illinois I seemed to have misplaced it or lost it, so I wasn't able to record any new videos uh, in order to uh, upload or even edit, so that was one reason why I didn't get anything done. The second reason is that even if I did have it, I was kind of busy doing a lot of uh, medical and uh, academ academic uh, stuff, so even if I did have it, I would probably not have found the time to work on uh, work on new videos. Ugh. Trying to focus and uh, play Smash Brothers at the same time, or trying to focus playing Smash Brothers and recording at the same time is kind of difficult, um, which is why I put him on level 6 instead of level 9 than I usually do. Uh, but yeah, that's the main reason why I haven't been up up updating, updating on the channel. I did want to get to continue on with Mega Man Command Mission now that uh, I got a lot of Frogger videos out. I will be getting back to doing that soon. It's just only that I'm still trying to get used to my new capture device thanks to my friend uh, Andreas. Uh, if I if I pronounce that correctly, uh, still getting used to. God. Oop. He was the guy that uh, originally gave me the first capture device that I had, so it's nice that uh, I actually really thank him for uh, this update uh, or upgrade uh, from uh, composite and S video to uh, HDMI and S video. I'm still able to record old older systems. I just need to use an adapter for that. But either way, I can get back to recording videos. And I'm probably going to be doing that tomorrow, uh, the time this video is being recorded. I don't know when this video will actually be uploaded, maybe even the same day as it's I'm doing it. But uh, yeah, I'll soon get back to doing Frogger and Mega Man X Command Mission. Uh, I don't know how long it's going to take for me to finish up, uh, up or editing them and then uploading them. I just know that I can finally start getting back to it. And since I already finished one of my cl uh, college classes, I will have some more time to actually work on them. Just don't know when I'll be actually doing that. Uh, besides the capturing device, I also got a new microphone. A, if I remember correctly, it's called a Blue Snowball Microphone. Usually used for podcasting, interviews, and, uh, tr or, and also music or lyric, vocal, singing kind of stuff. Uh, I'm still trying to get used to like how it's... Right now the the uh, capture device says that my commentary is actually really loud. Uh, hopefully it's not too loud. Another thing is that I also he also sent a pop filter which prevents me from or prevents the video from getting any popping noises from it. Which is which is good uh, to have. I never really had, never really thought about it because I, I did think about getting like stupid quality microphone before, but I knew that was expensive, or at least I think they were expensive, and never thought about pop filters. So that's good to see that uh, I actually got one now, and hopefully that the problem that I did not know about is being dealt with now that I have this. 
Uh, you know what? Just put random. So what does this mean? I have a new HDMI uh, capture device. It means I can expand the games I can play. But the thing is that I don't know how many games I'll actually use the HDMI feature for. The main reason because of that is that... Well, I mostly like doing games that I know or like that I have interest in at, 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 on my own. Well, of course, we're fighting Julie Um uh, Like, for example, I didn't really. A lot of the games that I've been playing are mostly uh, games that aren't like. games that you would probably see from most Let's Players. As in, like, doing Mario 64, uh, doing. I don't know, Kirby, uh, Kirby's. Adventure, something like something that you, most Let's Players would probably do, or most players have done. I've been mostly doing things that uh, not a lot of people have either made a lot of videos of or uh, don't do as often, like Journey to Silius, Magical Dorpy, and uh, and uh, Sweet Home. Um, and, th and that's the same with like my current videos. Not a lot of uh, even though Mega Man X Command Mission, ca you can say is like a um, a game that I don't want to say mainstream because that's not really what it is but say like a game that probably a lot of let's players have done before uh, but Mega Man X command mission is kind of a special case since it's like you know a different form of the genre and uh, I don't think a lot of people have even known about uh, Mega Man X command mission just know about the mainstream uh, classic and X games or numbered ones at least and same with Frogger I actually seen a review of Frogger, or like talking about a game that's very underrated, and they were talking about Frogger 2, the sequel to Frogger 1, for the PlayStation I mean. But for some reason throughout that whole entire video that I watched, it did not mention the play the first game. It, well, technically it did, but it was talking about the arcade uh, original instead of the PlayStation 1 original, or version that uh, it was actually supposed to be a sequel to. So, I see that that game, and not to mention when I f wanted to do a Let's Play of uh, Frogger, or that Frogger He's Back, not a lot of videos were made about it, not even a lot of Let's Plays, as well as the music for the game. And so I thought, you know, why don't I do that game? Uh, turns out, after I looked up uh, Frogger videos for a while after I started uploading, it looks like some people have actually shown up to uh, do some Let's Plays of it, which is nice. But yeah, most of the games I do is like something that you probably wouldn't see more often. I mean, I will occasionally get into or do a Let's Play of games that I really want that I really like and want to do, but I don't know when that will be. One of the things I really want to do was uh. Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga and or like the series in general so I and I don't know if I'll still be doing that for one it's a very long game or at least long if you're doing a let's play of it uh, or in segments um, not, not to mention it has grown in pop popularity for let's plays especially now uh, that uh, Chugga Conroy has made a let's play of it which is not a bad thing but it is that uh, it it means that it's more well it's more known or at least that's been done by uh, a much I would say professional let's player as I'm not a professional I obviously have a lot of faults in my videos for one I can't stop myself from saying uh the other thing is that I don't have everything pre-planned as he does or at least has an idea of what he's doing when he goes in which some people might say that that's a that's it's better to go in blind, but I don't know. Um, no, let's. I'm gonna try my uh, characters and see how they do in a fight. Let's see. Let's get you in. The fighter, the sword, the brawler, the sword fighter. The gunner, and technically gunner, but I would say more of the uh, mage of the group. All right. Um. You know what? Let's start with. Let's go with uh, Dreamland. 
Good old classic. But yeah, I'll be able to do HDMI based games like say, uh, like I, I can now do games on Wii U, PS3, and such, as well as continue doing videos on older systems. Uh, though it's going to be a little tricky to record those, but uh, I can still do them. It's still possible, and it's not too hard. It's just only a, uh, takes a little bit of a process to actually get it all set up. But besides that, I think we're, I'm all set for doing new videos soon. And hopefully more frequently, so that way, because... I feel like when I leave uh, the channel quiet for a while, it tends I tend to lose views or... Well, not well. Views are important to me. It's more of like actually making content for other people, for people to watch. And when I don't upload, I feel like I lose the interest in those people, and that's what causes me to, uh, you know, not have not have these videos like actually be some, something to entertain someone. And you know, I generally when I started this channel, I generally wanted to mostly focus on just entertaining and views didn't really matter and today to this day it still doesn't matter to me as there's been many attempts from other uh, people to like incorporate me into their channel as in like group let's play channels and all that but uh, I've turned them down because I just want to stick to just doing the way I do uh, I don't really want to use another channel or just get in a group just to get more views or be m more noticed by them I mostly just want to do it the natural way of just doing what I love to do and staying that way until, you know, time comes where I actually start growing as a uh, Let's Player or a YouTuber. I mean, I wouldn't say I can compare to Markiplier, but he started off as just a simple uh, YouTube channel or, or uh, a guy that just makes videos. And slowly he grew, he grew to this huge channel that just became a phenomenon on YouTube. And I feel like that's the same thing that I want to do. I just want to make videos to entertain, and if that if it actually entertains a lot of people, then well, uh, good for me. But that's what I, I mostly just focus on doing the videos because I love to actually make them. I don't do them just because I want to be famous. Oh, there we go. Well, at least I lasted longer. Uh, I was mostly kind of focused on uh, talking, so I'm surprised I was actually surviving for that long. Uh, I guess I could just finish this up. Uh, ah, come on, get that. There we go. I will say that doing th these videos will be a little tricky. I'm hoping that the audio, or that at least the commentary, is not too loud. And if it is, well, that just, it's actually kind of good because I i originally wanted to do this uh, update video with Splatoon, but besides not being able to find an online match uh, very well, uh, I couldn't really see the screen as, my ta as the desk that I have the laptop set up, or at least the microphone as well, is right next to the television. So I would have to move a little bit back and to the and to the left in order or no to the right I'm yeah to the left of the of the room just so I can actually see the screen and see what I'm doing since the game doesn't have gameplay or gamepad support for or gamepad screen support yep and there she goes all right brother versus brother I'll give him a chance Sorry if I'm a little quiet. Oop. And that's it. Uh, thank you guys for listening. I, I know it's a little bit of a lengthy update video. But, uh... I don't know. I, I just felt like discussing all of this, as well as keeping you guys informed of like what's going on. I know I caught... I, 
keep on disappearing and then reappearing just for a little bit and then disappearing again, but uh, I hope in the future I can prevent this from happening and, you know, keep a good flow of videos being made and up, uh, uploaded. The thing is that I, unlike Markiplier and uh, possibly Chugga Conroy, I'm not sure. No, I, I think he does it on his own, but uh, like Markiplier and a lot of other channels, I don't have somebody editing the videos for me and... You know, I'm just a, I'm just a guy with a laptop, uh, capture device, and a microphone, and very little knowledge of video editing. So I'm doing my the best I can to edit quickly, but I don't know. So, anyways, thank you guys for listening. I hope to get the next video for Mega Man X Command Mission up soon, and I will see you guys next time.